Great to see you because I obviously can't see you right now, but it has been almost three weeks now since you and I have celebrated Mass together. And um, I really miss praying and worshiping with you. And um, so today we're going to try something new. Um, hello, everyone. I want to thank all of you for your great positive responses to last week's first ever virtual message. Uh, I'm really so glad to hear that it was helpful to all of you to see and hear me as a, just one small way of feeling connected to our faith community here at St. Mary's. During these past three months of quarantine and isolation, I'm sure many of you have gathered around your kitchen table every day to share a meal together. Hello, everyone. On this day, when our country inaugurates a new president, I think it's a good time for us to remember the importance of sharing some kindness and bringing some light. Hello, everyone. It's good to be back at church after 16 days away. Happy Advent, everyone. This past weekend, we celebrated the first Sunday of Advent. Hello, everyone. This is the fourth week of Advent and Christmas is just around the corner. Are you ready for Christmas? Hello, everyone. I can't believe it has already been four weeks since I've shared a video message with you, especially after I promised to do this every other week. Hello, everyone. I hope you all found special ways to celebrate Christmas and enjoy the holiday safely with your family and friends. This past Sunday, we celebrated the third Sunday of Advent, which as many of you know, is always called Gaudete Sunday. Happy Easter, everyone. Yes, it is still Easter time, and I hope you have not stopped finding ways to share the good news that Jesus is risen and with us. This weekend, we celebrate the Feast of the Most Holy Trinity. So if I asked you what word or image comes to mind when you think of the Trinity, what would you say? Happy Easter, everyone. Does that greeting sound funny to you? 
like maybe I forgot we celebrated Easter almost two weeks ago. Happy Easter, everyone. Um, we know we are about halfway through the season of Easter. Um, and I'm wondering, are you still finding ways to celebrate Easter time every single day? Happy Easter and Feast of Ascension, everyone. As we continue to walk these days of Easter time, this weekend, we also celebrate the Feast of the Ascension. Hello to all of you. You know, I never thought I'd be sitting here choosing to send you this video message today. So let me tell you why I decided to resurrect this idea of doing these messages again. Hello everyone. It's hard to believe that last year at this time, our churches were closed. There was no gathering on Palm Sunday for a procession where we waved our palm branches and sang hosannas. I know that many of you are still not feeling safe and comfortable coming to Mass on the weekends. And I want you to know that I respect that decision of yours in making for the safety and well-being of your family. Hello everyone. I'm really glad to be with you today. And I know you are gonna be very interested in watching this video because I'm going to interview Father Kevin Ripley, who is our new priest celebrant here at St. Mary's. Happy Easter, everyone. Yes, we are still celebrating the Feast of Easter this
goes out. We thank you for leading her. We thank you that you go ahead of her and that you anoint every step that she takes, God. We thank you for her faithfulness to you, Lord. God, I just pray right now that you fill her with your spirit that she knows from the top of her head to the tips of her toes that you are with her. We love you. Thanks for being here tonight.